Welcome friends to this channel once again. Uh, this video is actually a continuation of our previous three videos because we have the part one of this video, we have part two, we have part three, and then this is the fourth part of this very topic, the scripted terms used in osteology. And then these are the three terms we shall be looking at today. What is the meaning of glenoid cavity? What is the meaning of cotyloid cavity? Then the meaning of a sinus. As usual, I will show you examples as I uh, describe these terms to you. So the first one here is a glenoid cavity. What is a glenoid cavity? It refers to a shallow articular depression. A glenoid cavity is a shallow articular depression. Okay, found on bony surfaces or structures. Okay, so an example. Is the is a glenoid cavity? Okay, this is the glenoid cavity. Okay, the glenoid cavity. This bone as a whole is the pectoral gedo. Okay, that's the scapula, and then on the ventral angle of this scapula, you have the glenoid cavity. Okay, so this is actually for attachment with the head. The humerus okay so this is a glenoid cavity it is a cup shaped cavity it's also referred to as cup shaped cavity the second term we shall look at is a cotyloid okay now a cotyloid is actually um, just like the glenoid cavity but it is a it is deeper okay so uh, the cotyloid is actually a more uh, deeper articular depression Okay, it's a deeper articular depression, and uh, it is the um, same as the acetabulum. Okay, so on the oscose, on the hip bone or pelvic girdle, we have the, the acetabulum, which is an example of a cotyloid. Okay, so as you can see, it is actually uh, deeper than the glenoid cavity. So this is a glenoid cavity on the pectoral gedo and then we have the cotyloid or the acetabulum on the pelvic gedo. So this one is a, a glenoid cavity while this is a cotyloid or acetabulum. The next term we shall look at is uh, the sinus. Okay, The sinus is actually an egg cavity air cavities within uh, bony structures okay and air cavities or air cavity or air, uh, air cavities within a bone now in live animal these air cavities okay this is a skull that has been cut okay to reveal the presence of these various sinuses okay in the live animal it, uh, the, the, the sinuses are lined by a mucous membrane. Okay, so a cavity is an air-filled uh, uh, space. Okay, within the bone. Okay, thank you very much for watching. Uh, this is just a short video, and um, we'll stop here for now. Um, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, Dr. Fred Academy. And do well to click on the notification bell icon when you have done so. Also, drop your comments uh, when there is a need for that. Thank you.